Hey guys, it's Attack Nerd here today. I'm going to be showing you how to use your lock button through the device itself on an iPhone, iPad, or iPod. So it's super easy. Some of you guys probably broke your lock button by dropping the device or whatever. So we're going to teach you how to use it through the device. It's going to be easy and you probably don't have to go repair the lock button, which costs around, I'm guessing, 40, 50 bucks. So it's super easy. You want to turn your device on, go into settings. And in settings, you want to go to general. I'm already in general. So once you're in general, you want to go to accessibility. In accessibility, you'll see a lot of features come out, but today we're just going to be focusing on the lock button itself. You want to go to assistive touch and turn it on. Once you turn assistive touch on, we're going to back out from the setting, you'll see a little box up here which you can move wherever you really want. So here, if you click on it once, you'll see all the features come up that you can use. Your home button, your lock button, Siri, your favorites. But today, as usual, we're just focusing on the lock button. We'll go to device, and here you'll see your lock screen button right there. You just tap it once, and your screen's off. So there you go, guys. That's how to use your lock button through the device itself. But if you were to turn it on, obviously you can't use your lock button because it's broken. So you'll have to use your home button once, and it's back on and your buttons to there. Oh, after a while of not using it, it'll fade out, not to annoy you. That's I like that feature. I'm going to turn it on. And there's here. I'm going to sh show you guys one more time. And those are all your features right there. One more thing about the button. I really like how you can move it and it's not restricted in one corner like this because that annoys me. Let's say I'm writing a message or something. Or I don't know. I don't want it in my way. So good thing you can move it to wherever you want. So I'm just going to move it in that corner. Try it one more time. Device lock screen. There you go. Alright, guys, thanks for watching. There was my tutorial how to use your lock button through the device itself. Don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe. And as usual, I'm going to be posting many more videos on tutorials through your Apple devices. And yep, iTechNerd, and I'm out.